hi guys welcome to another video with mel today i've got a small dvd and game haul for you today to show you um so i've just been picking up a few things things i wanted to see and then i've been looking for some nostalgic stuff so i'll start with that one um so you guys know i've been on this kind of sabrina the teenage witch kick at the moment um so i went and i was wondering if there were any games to do with sabrina the teenage witch and i found this playstation one which is called a twitch in time uh, when I bought it off eBay, it just come with the disc and the booklet. Um, I have no idea how good or bad this is going to be, but, but judging by the back, it looks like it's going to be pretty bad. But it was only a pound, so fair enough. Uh, it looks like it's got Sabrina dressing as an Egyptian and fighting Egyptian guys. And I'm guessing she time travels, which I would love. This was made in 2001. Um... We've got a little bit of a story in here, just a little like guide that tells you about it. Apparently she's going to go to Rome, so she has a really appropriate outfit, um, otherwise she won't get special access to things, so that's useful. Um, let's see, special spells she has as well. Um, she can make herself bigger or smaller, that's quite cool. Uh, she can also freeze baddies. Um, she can uh, transform a, a bad guy into a slimy frog. I uh, Hopefully she doesn't have to kiss him or something like that. That would be horrible. Uh, <laughs> uh, you can also squish people. <laughs> and uh, you can also do one where you can hoist bad guys up in the air by their ankles. That's kind of funny. Um, and then you can also do one watch your um, watch the villains float away to outer space. That's also kind of evil. Don't like that. Um, yeah, so she's got, they've got like these zippers in different levels. So when she goes through things, she like opens a zipper. That sounds really weird. I might have to play this game for you guys and show you. Because I've not played it yet, but it just sounds really, really odd. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd give it a go. Since I do love myself some Sabrina the Teenage Witch. And I thought, why not? We'll have a go at it. It's a PlayStation 1 game, um, which I believe will play on my PlayStation 2. So I'll have a go with that and see if it's any good. It probably will be horrible, but that's half the fun, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so the other things I picked up. I picked up some DVDs. So first thing I picked up was uh, The Room DVD. I've not seen this movie yet. I've heard really, really good things about it. Um, I also have the book on my Kindle that I got for free, but I haven't read it yet, and I should really. Um, but I wanted to check this one out for a while, so I picked that one up. And then the next thing I picked up is something else I want to check out, which I never saw air in the UK. I don't know if it is airing in the UK. If you guys know if the second season is going to air here, please let me know in the comments because I'd like to check it out. There's not very many episodes on this, so I could easily get caught up and watch the second season if it's going to be here. And that is Ash vs. the Evil Dead. I love Bruce Campbell. Who doesn't love him? He's wonderful. Um, I've met him at Comic Con. I was lucky enough to be in the audience um, for the... Um, what was it called? Uh, the spy show he was on. I can't remember his name now. Oh, it just went from me. Oh, it'll come back to me in a minute. And he was there, and he was just like the center of attention the whole time. And that was just great, having him there. Um, really looking forward to him being Ash from the Evil Dead again, because who doesn't love the Evil Dead? Everybody loves the Evil Dead. And they especially love Ash. Ash is awesome. Um, so, yeah. So, we've got Ash vs. the Evil Dead. I've wanted to pick, check this series out since I saw it announced. Uh, apparently Lucy Lawless is also in the series, so Xena is also there, which is amazing. Um, I'm actually picking up a comic in a few months, which is Ash um, from the Evil Dead and Xena crossover, and it sounds amazing. So I really want to check this out, get up to date on it. I think I'll really like this, so Ash vs. the Evil Dead, uh, the series one. So very interested in that. And then I picked up some South Park. Cause I, South Park restarted here. It's the 20th anniversary of South Park. So I'm wanting to watch some old episodes. I only have a couple seasons on DVD. So I picked up season 7 of South Park. Mostly because I saw um, a meme of the Jennifer Lopez um, taco taco thing that Cartman does with, with the little puppet he has. So I had to watch that again because it's been a long time since I saw that episode and it is quite a funny episode. Um, a lot of good episodes on this one. Uh, another one that I quite like. I'm trying to find the other one that I liked. Um, 
are the raisins one. That's quite a funny episode as well on there. So I'm looking forward to watching some of that and reliving a little bit of South Park memories. So those were the uh, DVDs and games I picked up over the last week. Not a huge haul, but my collection is already quite big, so I don't really need that many. <laughs> Plus, I have Netflix and Sky, and I don't need that many more things. Um, yeah, so that's what I picked up this week, and I will see you guys later. Please remember to subscribe to my channel, and bye bye Hey, guys! Mel here! I really want you to subscribe, subscribe, want you to subscribe, subscribe, want you to click that button below. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe!